You know, very seldom do you have an opportunity to interview someone you both respect and admire, but then whom you also know and love. So that's how I feel. Well, this is just, I tell you, I've been so looking forward to this tonight. You know, what makes an assignment like Hawaii tricky, not only are you there over your holiday, but I think what people don't realize is that when you're doing live shots from Hawaii, you're waking up at midnight. And look at our first story, which is a breaking news story that I did. Uh, this is an example of that. About the size of a closet. I mean, it's the most claustrophobic space. Smaller than your space at NBC 10? Oh, yeah. It's, oh, okay. Well, well we, <laughs> let's, there are four seats. And, oh, <laughs> and I would come home for vacations and Bill, Bill, one of the best and he will tell you everything yes. you're doing wrong and yes. everything that yes. you have to improve <laughs> yes. and he'll and he yes. makes you better yes. now that I'm in the Washington DC Bureau sometimes I have to pinch myself because one of my uh, you know along those lines of giving advice to the journalism students yeah. here um, if there's someone sitting out there who just has fire in the belly, yeah. they want to do what Kristen Welker does. Yeah. What would be, and you've given such terrific advice, but what would be sort of the one piece of advice you would, you would give? At some point, I want to cover the White House. And my news director said, okay, well, the White House is a long ways away, <laughs> but um, we do have a city council. So why don't you go and cover city council all the time? And I thought, I'm going to get this job. I can't wait till they make it official. It's going to be great. And, you know, I was working seven days a week to do it. And it's probably not even a fair yeah. question yeah. to ask you because I, I know. By the way, it's not just White House officials. It's Capitol Hill, you know, lawmakers, Capitol Hill aides, uh, because building sources is ultimately about trust. And the, the one other point I will make is that when a source gives you a piece of information and they say it's off the record, the only feedback I used to get when I first came here was, well, you need a touch-up relaxer or your hair is a mess. And the amazing Kristen uh, Welker. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, thank you all so much. Thank you. Thank you all for coming. That was so fun. Nay is one of my early heroes in broadcast news. And so for me to be sitting up here with her is a true honor. Well, so. you're a sweetheart. Well, a sweetheart. I mean it. Okay. This is going to be a love fest. This is going to be a love fest. <laughs> I sound like